imagine if you hung up the moment Anthony first called your show and we saw a look of sadness in Rick Voss's eyes. Aha. But Rick was nothing without Owen. I'd be real here. <clears throat> Tony, I think you're getting excited because I'm giving you attention. Let's slow down a little bit. Reread what you wrote before you push send, okay? <clears throat> I mean, Rich Voss, just an average, quick, comic, great with the one-liners. Definitely did a lot of great stuff for the radio show. Um, but, yeah, I mean, he's not doing much outside the Opie and Anthony world. Let's be honest with each other. Of course not. Tony Speed, Voss is a is legit a legend. He gave Paul Mooney a joke that ended up on the Chappelle show that led to one of Chappelle's Wayne Brady bits. Voss deserves a lot of credit. He's a very good writer and he's been used. Chris Rock has used him. A lot of people have used uh, Rich Voss for his writing. He's very good, but he really can't hold a show on his own. He's very good when he comes in as a guest and he's a sniper and he can hit everybody with his quickness and his one liners. But as far as, trying to have an actual conversation, a long-form conversation on a radio show, it was absolute torture. Torture. But when you use Voss properly, he was um, he was absolutely amazing.